Squares and Square Roots with Dr. Nick. Hi. A square is a four-sided object with right angles that the four sides are all the same. And when we find the area of a square, we multiply the two dimensions. Here is a five by five square, and you can see it has an area of 25 squares. Five times five equals 25. We can write that as five to the power of two equals 25, and sometimes we call that five squared equals 25. Here's another square. It's three by three. It has an area of nine squares. So we've got three times three equals nine, or three to the power of two equals nine, or three squared equals nine. In the same way, we can have four squared is four times four, which is 16, five squared, five times five equals 25, six squared is 36, seven squared, 49, and an interesting one, 10 squared is 10 times 10, which equals 100. These numbers here are called perfect squares because they are the squares of whole numbers. Square roots. Now, square roots are the opposites of squares. So if we have a square and we know the area, but we don't know what the sides are, that's why we, when we would need to use a square root. So we'll use the square root button in our calculator and the square root of 25 equals 5. Because 5 to the power of 2 or 5 times 5 equals 25. And here's a square of area 81. To find the length of a side, we'd find the square root of 81, which is 9. And that is because 9 times 9 equals 81. And one more, the square has an area of 36. How long is the side? We find the square root of 36 is 6. And that is because 6 squared, or 6 times 6, equals 36. And here are some square roots for you to look at. Square root of 9 is 3, square root of 16 is 4, and so on. So that is what squares and square roots are.